Hey, what's up everybody? It's Phil here and welcome back to another episode on the channel. Today we're back on Overlord Realm. It is actually reset. The whole thing is started again. Just like Blaze at a fresh start, I believe the first map was actually just a test map. So this is the first official one. And guess what faction your boy got into? None other than clickbait. So I mean, there could be some episodes where I'm in the call with them, you know? Pretty hyped about that, honestly. It's uh, it's awesome. Hopefully I'm not going to get kicked when they realize they're like running out of spots and you need to get some like higher up people in the faction or something. But for the time being, we're in the faction and I'm hoping I can join in on a bunch of cool raids and get some good content and everything from that and i know you guys have been hyped about blaze and i'm gonna do both my plan is to do both of them but since i have the next two weeks off of school i have plenty of time to record both so i can keep two series going at once obviously it'll say in the title whether it's overlord or blaze now if you guys prefer one over the other um you can just focus on watching that or you can watch both if you just want to watch my content in general it's up to you guys i'm not going to force you either way obviously but yeah guys i'm actually super hyped this is going to be fun i've never been in a faction with youtubers before so i don't know if they're going to like have an eye out for content and stuff i'm really hoping that's the case but look at that guys 3900 players on they just did a little, a little update in the chat i'm lagging a load but that's great to see guys i'm glad to see that psycho's out here thriving but i don't know what the plan is for the faction i don't know if they started on a base or anything i also don't know if i'd be trusted or anything with this stuff so i don't know how i can help with that i might go ahead and ask them and i might join the discord i'm not really sure just because i've had trouble in the past with joining discord calls and recording because the audio picks up through my mic so i'm not sure how that's gonna work out but i'm just hyped to be in this faction man i'm hoping this is gonna be a good map and everything i'm fine not leading the faction like i said on blaze it's it's better to be in a faction that's actually active and i can just help out now you would think we're gonna grind a base straight off the bat but you know <laughs> with youtubers you know, we're going to go, I believe Yellow Wool wants to go record some Loot Lake, which is obviously not the most productive thing to do early off in the map. All right, uh, Factions Raven wants to go on Discord with me, man. I got to see what's up. No way, boys. We're already moving up the ladder in the faction. Uh-oh. Here comes the call. You just want to do Kit Weekly? Did it come to late? Yeah, sure. Do you want to go forward? Uh, I would love to, yeah. If I can actually get <laughs> All right, I made it. I made the it. Lag. Oh, there's a lot of people down here. I should have gotten more health pods. Uh, Phil, let's right. go this way, this way. Oh, I'm getting attacked, man. Are you fighting yeah, I don't have any splash right, bombs. Right, I pearled away. Right. I pearled right into someone else. else uh oh. <laughs> I'm definitely about to die. Yeah, I tried to pearl away. Uh -oh. Oh, no, I, see you. I mean, I'm just in weekly, so it's not that big of a deal. Yeah, I I oh, we got some truces like... over here. Alright, I'm chilling yeah, with these truces. Yo, this guy's gonna Alright, I'm coming back. I have literally two uh, two health no, bombs. He's got, he's got pots. Oh, we got a lot of truces here. Wow. Hacker, 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 go, 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 go. Is there actually? There's a hacker. No. I want to help. I have no splash pots. We need this man banned. Oh, what the heck? Uh oh. This guy just hit me with poison. I had to go with my truce. No, this guy's gonna kill me. I've literally, I have no health. <laughs> I have no health whatsoever. Oh, I'm so dead. I'm about to die. I need to. Oh, I'm half heart. I'm dead. Dang it. <laughs> we should, we should make a farm or something. I feel like. Oh, I see. Okay, so they have an actual like farm and everything. So, all right. Raven already has fly. Are you kidding me? <laughs> It's a command gem. It was from last oh, time. Oh, okay. So, okay, nice. Are you just... Are you no, I was making them all into melons. Oh, holy frick. Or into okay. seeds. This is nice. How many people do they have working on this? So, did they buff fishing or no? Because I remember I did it a while ago and it wasn't really that good. Uh, yeah, they, they introduced a bunch oh, of sweet. stuff. There's divine fish now, which sell for like 75k. Wow. Alright, so as you can see, the faction is already grinding away. A lot of people have Slash Fly that they carried over from last map, which I'm quite jealous of. But they've really done a lot of work already. I'm not sure. I think it's been up for an almost two hours now we have plenty of layers going but i think what i might do is go to slash basic and jump down and try and fish because there are some truces there they did kill me last time but i was invis so i don't know if they just didn't realize i was part of clickbait but i'm not sure we're gonna try and jump down again they're all standing like way over here hopefully gonna be chill with me because i see tg is here and they're not hitting him so i'm hoping they're gonna be fine with me the yellow wool's there too hopefully they're not gonna kill me i'm just hoping to get something worth a lot oh for fish i'm just gonna go ahead and put everything in the inner chest i get to maximize the profit I can have. But look at this. Everyone's just standing here fishing. But obviously, this is going to be extremely boring, so I'm only going to cut back whenever I win something from it. But I'm hoping to get a divine fish, because I've heard that those were $75,000, which would obviously be a massive boost for us. No, someone just hit me. A deluxe fish. Okay, I think that's 
5,000 or 10,000. But that is some nice profit right there. Now we do have $6.5,000 already. We sold an inventory of melon, so I probably should spend that on bone meal and such for the farm. But any money early map will be nice. Go ahead and put that away. This is so much nicer. Having a lot of truces around, I don't have to worry about like even wearing armor or anything. But guys, I'm so hyped about this map. It's going to be so nice to be in a faction that actually has YouTubers and stuff. Obviously some that are much bigger than I am. It's just going to be nice. Hopefully I can learn some stuff from them. Ooh, deluxe salmon. That's going straight in the ender chest. A salmon. A puffer fish. But again, I'm hoping you guys are cool with me having this and blaze going at once. Just because the opportunities for content are going to be a lot bigger if I have two going at once. And it's just a lot of fun. And I don't want to leave Overlord entirely because even though it was just like a kind of a demo map before, it was still a lot of fun to play on. And like now that I'm in clickbait, you know, it's just it's meant to be. Enchanted fish. Ooh. Okay, that's probably good. No, I got killed. Alright, let me go ahead and sell all the stuff I've got so far. We've got a decent haul. I'm hoping some of it's worth a lot, but... Alright, nothing too amazing. I think we had about 6,000 before, so 14,000 is actually pretty nice. Pretty soon we'll be able to buy Fortune 3. I believe that's like 25,000, something like that. Wait, let me just double check. Fortune is 25,000. I was right. So we're pretty close to that, actually. We could probably grind out another inventory of melons and then get that very soon. Or I could go back fishing. Boys, secured. Okay, we got it. What did we just get? Okay, wait, wait. A basic treasure chest. Now, this one is locked, but I believe you can open it with, like, souls or something. But that is awesome. Okay, so basic. It's obviously not the best. There is, I believe it's basic, advanced, and extreme. But this one, you don't need a lockpick to open. And lockpicks are insanely hard to get. So that's actually awesome. I'll have to open that up after this. No, someone killed me. Ah, that's too bad. Who was it? That guy. That sucks. But we do have plenty of stuff to sell, and also this basic treasure chest. So I'm not sure how much this costs, but if you go to slash shop, we can check out the locksmith to see how much it is. Slash souls, do we have enough? We only have 675 right now, so I'm not sure if we can afford it. But let me test it. So we go over, I believe, to the locksmith right here. Right click on him here. It costs 2,000 souls and $2,500. So we don't have enough right now. I'll put that in there. That's actually really lucky. I'm super hyped we got that. But for now, we can sell some more stuff. And then I guess we might want to buy a spawner or something so the faction can start grinding it. All right, we're now at 29,000. That is awesome. All right, should we go ahead and buy Fortune 3, do you guys think? I feel like we could. Let me do my slash kit rogue. Yeah, all right, we'll do that. We'll go ahead and put all of this good stuff away and then we will get it on the efficiency four axe. Go ahead and get Fortune 3. I feel like that's the smart thing to do. Three, there we go. We have $4,000 left, but if I go back to the home, grind out a little bit of melon, we should be back there in no time. Uh, it's kind of Sunday morning and I haven't done any recording since Friday night. So we have a lot to do. We have to catch up a little bit. I haven't leveled up at all. I haven't really pretty much been on the server whatsoever since that last recording I did. Now I do have $44,000 and I'm tempted to buy efficiency five just so I can upgrade the axe the slightest bit more so it's maxed out. Let's check it out. Um, efficiency is 37,500. That is expensive, but you know it's going to be worth in the long run. Now, I do have a couple more on the age, if I can find where they are. Sell those. Now we have $13,000 to work with. Now let's test this bad boy out. Alright, that, that instant mine is just so much better. Uh, like, I had efficiency 4 before this, but like the difference from 4 to 5 is just so substantial. But honestly, like minus the day and a half that I was inactive, I said we made some decent progress. Now, obviously, I didn't do too much of this. This was mostly the faction. I just helped a tad bit. And especially since I was gone, I didn't help at all. But I say we're doing we're doing decent for ourselves. Now I'm hoping to get another episode recorded right after this. It is quite late, but I want to grind it out. But I feel bad, guys. I haven't done hardly any recording. And especially now that I'm in a faction with YouTubers, man, like I got I gotta be on top of things. So we're gonna work on that. And I'm hoping I can get more gear and maybe do some more PvP next episode. See if I can get on at a time where there's other people actually doing something. But for the time being, all there is to really do is just grind melons, man. We gotta get some more money. So we can start buying spawners and everything because last map i mean we started out doing well we got up at like an, a level an episode but after that we just stopped making progress man and i just stopped uploading it was just it was just not good but this this map man this is the map it's gonna actually happen now my defense last map was just a beta test map so this is the first official map but tell me this isn't like the most satisfying thing of factions all right so before we end it off i'm gonna go ahead and sell these last two inventories of melons get us about was it 6900 in inventory that's that's pretty decent money right there which will bring us to a total of 25,000. So after buying efficiency five, as well as fortune 300 acts, we've made, we made a decent amount back. 
Now this axe is going to be very nice. We could upgrade the unbreaking on it, but apart from that, that's pretty much all we can do. Now eventually we could get a harvester axe, which I believe you can buy here. Yeah, harvester axe so it automatically puts it in, into your inventory, but that's 50,000, and I don't think it's really worth it at this point in time. But anyways, guys, I'm super hyped for the new season on Overlord. I'm glad I can actually be in a faction with other YouTubers. Like, again, if you're watching this, thank you for the invite. I'm hoping to be able to contribute more in the future to the faction, man, because I haven't really been too helpful this past weekend. Now there is still three more days on grace period. Is this a longer grace period? I feel like this is bigger than it usually is. I thought it usually just goes to next Monday. But either way, I think that's going to wrap up today's episode. We don't have any charms or anything to open up. So I'm just going to have to end it here. So if you guys enjoy, make sure to leave a like and subscribe for more factions if you haven't. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Peace.